this is Andrew Stanton over at Pixar Studios. Hi, Andrew. Sorry, you have to speak up louder. Twitch is dancing on my desk. Ellen, we've got a real problem. We're trying to finish the Finding Dory movie, and Dory is missing. Oh no, that sounds terrible. What can I do to help? Ellen, do you think you could find Dory? I think she went swimming in the ocean. Don't worry, Andrew. I'll find her and bring her back. I have my scuba gear right here, and I'm ready to help. That's great. Good luck, Ellen. I hope you find her. Hello, Ellen. What are you doing here? Hi, Clammy. I'm looking for Dory. She's missing. Hi, Ellen. My name's Bob. If you're looking for Dory, I haven't seen her. Hi, Ellen. I'm Jeff. I've been looking for Dory, too, and I haven't seen her. Okay, I'm going to keep looking for her. Hi, Ellen. I'm Spike. I thought I saw her earlier, but I can't find her now. Ray's here. Gee, I'm starting to worry. Where could Dory be? We've got to find her. She's got to get back to the studio. I'm Spot. I could spot anything, but I still haven't spotted Dory. I've got to find her. Time is running out. Hi, Ellen. I'm blue, and I'm awful blue that we can't find Dory. It's Lily here. I think Dory forgot to go to the studio. <laughs> oh, hi, Ellen. I'm Kai. I haven't seen Dory in such a long time. I'm worried about her. Hi, I'm Sebastian. I came from the Little Mermaid movie just to find Dory today. Hi, Ellen. It's Nemo. I heard you were looking for Dory. Have you tried looking in that treasure chest? Sometimes she hides out there. Dory, are you hiding in that chest? I've been looking all over for you. Oh, hi, Alan. I forgot. Am I supposed to be on the movie set? Yes, you are. Andrew sent me to find you and bring you back. Right back at you, Dory. I'm heading back to the studio. They're going to pick you up and deliver you to Andrew. Ellen, thank you for finding Dory. We picked her up at the ocean and now we can finish the movie. You're welcome, Andrew. I'm glad I could find her. Now you can finish your movie. Thank you so much for finding me, Ellen. I'll see you in the movies. So one day, Andrew Sanchin called Ellen DeGeneres and said, Ellen, Dory's missing. Oh no, said Ellen. What am I going to do? You must go find her. Okay, but I, I am the voice of Dory. I know. This Falcish is named Bob. Now we're making up names because they don't really belong in the movie. That one, next one's the clownfish. We're going to call him Nemo. Mm -hmm. And then, yeah, and we have another fish, he's red and orange. He's been called Jeff. Jeff, okay. Name's Jeff. Okay. Oh, we have a pretty eyed fish. Um, Lily. Lily, okay. And then we have a fat fish, Spot. Spot. See, 
best spots, huh? We have a rainbow fish. Um, Ray. Ray? Ray. Ray? Yeah. R E or R A? R A. Finally, we have this guy. Um, so, 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 S E W. So, S E W. So, huh. is Spike a perfect name for this guy? This is Twitch on the Ellen DeGeneres show. He really likes to dance, and so do I. Me too. This board is for uh, where the characters are going to go for the movie. Twitch is a dancer on the Elvin DeGeneres show. He's he's one of the greatest dancers in the world. And he does a really funny dances like this. So Twitch is on. Stanchion is one of the greatest directors of Pixar. He directed one of my favorite Pixar films, Finding Nemo. He also directed Wally, -E, and he's also directing this upcoming film called Finding Dory, which is what we are making a movie about now to promote for the new movie, going to be released on June 17, 2016. One of my dreams is to make some Pixar film or any Disney computer animated film. So one day when I grow up, I might work for Pixar or Disney Animation Studios. Andrew does the voices of these two characters, the Pelicans and Crush. These two characters are, it's really cool that the director actually voices these characters. We made up all the names to these characters that we have over here in the little fish. Like, yeah, well, we named we named this like Ray, Spike, we named Scott, we named Jeff, we named Bob. And right now I'm putting up Kai. I I I named him Spike because he has he's a puffer fish and those points are spiky, so I called him Spike. Put too much tape on this. <laughs> And these, the pelicans are in your window, we and that's a picture of Crush, that little, that turtle. We have and the tur he is 150 years old in the fucking oh, movie, he's like finding a kind of little pelican, some sort of animal. And these things, I'm not sure what they are. They're actually seagulls, I think. These are actually seagulls. I crossed out pelicans so I could fix it out. There we go. Now that's a lot better, isn't it? So as I was saying, Andrew Stanton now plays the seagulls. And these are, this is our character board. We're finally finished with it. And on these are my two favorite characters. 
Bob and Jeff and Bob are my favorites. And what are your favorites, Mark? My favorites are Dory, Ellen, uh, Nemo, the Seagulls and Crush, as well as Spike. I also kind of like Ray because he's a rainbow fish, and that's how I came up with the name Ray. Short I don't the background. It's been uh, it's been pretty tough. We've been working on these things for a long time. We just got the paints to do this. We have a big tray of paints over here. Let me go get it. So this is our storyboard, and these are all numbered so we don't so we know so we don't get mixed up. Like for example, here is number one, and here's number two, three, four, five, and so on. And it goes all the way to 17, which is the very end. Nigel here. Nigel. And this this is a little statue of Crush. And out there are the birds, the seagulls that he plays. And there says Oscar for Finding Nemo. And this is for... And this is a picture of Ellen because Ellen's going to be the main character in this. Hi! Okay, so now we're going to be talking about number two, which is in Ellen's office. As you can see, Ellen's trying to talk to, um, what's his name? Andrew Stanchion. Andrew Stanchion's on the phone. And when she is, Twitch is dancing on her desk. She has some flowers over here. She has a little pic, she has like a little statue of Dory. And then she also has... A picture of Andrew Stanchions on her wall. It's like Andrew Stanchions has a picture of her. Some of these characters, like I'm going to be Andrew Stanton and Bob, and Orion's going to be Ellen and Dory, and we need more people to play the voices of these. I'm going to try to see if some of my friends from school can help me finish up this film. Just by doing the voices of these fish characters. Perfect. So, Spike will be voiced by Papa. And I might need to ask my friends if they want to do the voices of Ray, Spot, Jeff, Bob, Kai, Nemo, Lily, Sue, on itself. Blue, Clammy, and Sebastian. We're going to show you how to do the animation. I just move this over here, press this button, and then it shows on the camera. I'll do the same thing with the treasure chest. And the clam. Oh, and the plant. Well, now this one, we do a new photo, we move the character a little bit, like that. See? It's a little easy, but it's a little complicated the first time. It gets easier and easier as you go on through it. But some can be challenging. But some can be challenging. If you wanted to move her legs, you could do that. Like this. And she could be swimming along the ocean. She could be moved over there. This is what we've been working on. Each uh, photo shows one frame and one movement at a time. You see? As the brown see. the brown line is the voice and the green line is the music that goes dun 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 You click on these one at a time and you'll see how the animation works. And just so you know, Pixar does computer animation. 
you look, here comes Bob. Well, 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 who do we have here? It's Jeff. 